Head coach John Lowry. And uh, senior captain Will Kidd. And just an opening statement about tonight's match. Yeah, a couple things. I mean, first, thanks to the University of Chicago for being great hosts. Um, just a tremendous job from top to bottom. Congratulations to Luther uh, for advancing to the quarterfinals. And uh, lastly, you know, proud of our effort, uh, proud of the steps we took this year, proud of advancing to this point, and uh, obviously disappointed, but uh, represented St. Thomas very well. Uh, and for that, we're proud. You know, I wasn't out there, but I was watching the video. Well, it looked like a battle. Kind of talk to me about what tonight's match was out there on the field. Yeah, I mean, it was a battle. Uh, we, it was a fight to the last whistle. Um, we had our chances in the, in the end there, and we couldn't put them away. And, yeah. Coach, this is a team you're familiar with. Of course. Because I've seen them a lot. Yeah. Um, kind of talk about uh, the match itself and um, maybe kind of what changed after they were able to put that goal in. Midway through yeah, the no, I, I think they, you know, they have a veteran group. They play well. Um, we, we wanted to try to keep two advanced midfielders in the game, and we had to uh, make an adjustment because of their success early to, to, to sit Will a little bit lower, uh, which we try to avoid. Uh, we, I think the game settled, and we got through the first half reasonably well. I mean, I thought 0-0 zero, zero was an appropriate result at that time. Um, and I thought we started the second half very bright. Um, a, a softer goal. You know, we haven't conceded much in the last couple of weeks. We haven't conceded anything in the last couple of weeks, so I think that was surprising. Um, but our response was fantastic and uh, a real testament to what guys like Will and our other seniors, Andrew and Walter and Aiden, uh, the, the example they set that we're not we're not going down easy. And uh, it, we did we did end our journey today, but we, we fought to the very end, and that's all you can ask for as a coach. And you know, I'm just mentioning that senior <coughs> class, three seniors, four, four, including a very important goalkeeper. Correct. As we'll talk about what the, those guys have kind of meant for this program. Uh, everything. You know, I think uh, the the appreciation I have for Will Kidd, the appreciation I have for Walter Alvarado, the appreciation I have for Aiden Hogan, and, and also Andrew Stumpfig is at a personal level because I just think the world of them, and I love being their coach. Uh, but but I also think it's uh, they've, they've left such a great legacy for what our program stands for, what our athletic department believes in, what our university expects. Um, so the, the, it's a disappointing way to, to to end things. But you know we we came into this season with a lot of unknowns, um, and I just give so much credit to Will and his classmates and and all the guys and staff uh, and support staff for putting this thing together as we learned and, and getting it to where it, we got it to. And Will, uh, looks like you were part of a Final Four team a couple of years ago. No, I was not. I was not on the team yet. Transferred I transferred in after. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But going back to that, kind of talk about what it's been like to be part of, of this ride. I mean, and this is not where you wanted to end. I know it's yeah. not that into words right now, but what yeah. has this team kind of meant to you? Um, I came into this team. Um, uh, last year as a junior, I came in. I came in as a role player. I just came in, tried not to mess anything up because they had things going, it seemed like, after a Final Four appearance. Um, and then this year, I knew I had to step up as leader, and I think I did that. And I was patient with the guys because it was a young team, and I think we really came together at the end. It's just we didn't get the result today. Coach, any final thoughts? No, just thanks again for a great weekend, and good luck to uh, Luther in Chicago tomorrow. Thank you, guys.